Hello and welcome to Two Car Pros. Today we're going to show you six easy tests to detect a blown head gasket in an automobile. Test number one. With the engine cold, remove the oil filler cap to inspect for a milky brown goo that is collected on the bottom of the cap. This is an indication that coolant has been leaking into the oil. This leakage could be generated by a cracked cylinder head block or leaking manifold in some cases, although in this situation the head gasket is more prone to this kind of failure. Test number two. Head gaskets are designed to control engine coolant in and around the engine block and cylinder heads. When they fail, they can cause a leak, which can be found by removing all the spark plugs. Pressurizing the coolant system and cranking the engine over while observing the spark plug holes, if coolant is present at any one of the holes, the head gasket is blown. It is a good idea to disable the ignition or fuel system fuse before testing to avoid fire. Test number three. While the engine is cool, remove the radiator cap, and if a head gasket has failed, it is allowing combustion gases into the cooling system, and they can be detected by removing the cap and observing liquid while the engine is running. You should see a continuous stream of bubbles. Test number four. To confirm exhaust gases inside the cooling system, use a chemical tester. Drain a small amount of coolant from the radiator as to not contaminate the test. This is what a typical block testing fluid looks like. It's available at any auto parts store or Amazon. Once the coolant has been drained down slightly, insert the test tube and add the test fluid to the fill line. Next, start the engine while using the hand pump to draw air inside the radiator through the tester. While testing the radiator air, the test fluid will turn yellow if exhaust gases are present, or remain blue indicating the opposite. This is test number five. A head gasket can fail between cylinders, causing a consistent two-cylinder misfire. To check for this condition, remove each cylinder spark plugs while conducting a compression test. If two readings are consistently low in neighboring cylinders, this can be an indication of a failure between these cylinders. I'll put a link in the description below to a more detailed test for this. Test number six. Some engines are designed with oil pressure passing through the engine block and into the cylinder head via the gasket. When the gasket fails, it can cause an engine leak which is detectable by inspection. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please visit 2 Car Pros. And if this video has helped you at all, please give it a like.